We just checked the blood test results and your HbA1c, the three months average of sugar, mm -hmm. the last week that was about 6.3. Mm -hmm. That's really good because HbA1c, which means like a, that shows how much sugar bound to your red blood cells, you know? Yeah, yeah. And then the having blood test for HbA1c is not affected by eating something sweet, you mm -hmm. know, before blood test because they can give you three months of average. Yeah, yeah. And then 7%, that's the borderline, mm -hmm. which means the 6.3 is really good, mm -hmm. okay? Mm -hmm. Just be 9 point something, you know? But yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So, um, you haven't had any numbness in your feet? No. 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 When you walk around, any aching pain in your calf no. muscle? No, no that's no. good. Because that's a symptom of lack of circulation. Oh, so, okay. now I'm, go I'm going to check your nerve sensation in your sole of the foot and toe, and then, I want to check your circulation. Yeah. Okay. okay. So you know this one, monofilament. Mm -hmm. It's a little ticklish one. Yeah. So I want to touch your sole of the foot and toe, and tell me which foot I'm touching, mm -hmm. left or right. Okay. okay. So close that, please. Okay. Yeah, right. That's very good. So I checked the 10 nerve branches mm -hmm. first. Six out of 10, that's normal. Mm -hmm. You got 10 out of 10, 10 out of here. That's really good, okay? But still, you better check your feet you know, every day, yeah. especially after shower. You know, mm -hmm. I recommend putting some moisturizing cream you know, every day, yeah, because yeah. winter time is very dry, yeah, okay? Yeah, so when you put some cream on your legs and your feet, check the skin condition. Yeah. And if you find any blister, any open wound, or even you know, callus, whatever, mm -hmm. and then if you feel uh, something going on, so especially open wound, if you see any yellowish color yeah. or like a, any x rays, then that can be the risk of like an infection. Okay? Yeah, right. So if you find any uh, skin break and then if you suspect any infection, just come here, don't yeah. wait. Okay? okay. And now I'm going to check your circulation. So put some gel on top. And then. So a little ultrasound, I'm going to check your circulation. That's fine. And then your ankle. Very good. <laughs> so that's stronger. And then I can hear even third sound. So now your left one. Again, that's good. And then your ankle. Okay, that's good as well. So you can hear boom, boom, mm -hmm. boom, boom, like that. First sound, that's from your heart. Yeah, yeah. Second sound in your foot, because your heart is pumping the blood. Mm -hmm. Blood reaches to the foot through the arteries. Mm -hmm. And because your arteries are healthy, so you have a bounce back. Yeah. So you have a boom, 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 like mm -hmm. that. When people have lack of circulation, they don't have a second sound in your foot. Yeah, right. yeah because of narrow the arteries or block the arteries. So there is no bounce back. Okay, mm -hmm. and also with the circulation problems, as you know, people suffer with the aching pain in the calf yeah. muscle. Mm -hmm. Maybe they can walk on it 50 meters or 100 meters, but they start to feel pain in the calf muscle. Mm -hmm. They have to stop and sit down 
otherwise really painful. Yeah. So that's the symptom of lack of circulation. We call that like a peripheral artery disease. Yeah. Okay. When the art when the circulation is really bad, then people suffer with a burning pain on toes. Mm -hmm. Burning pain on toes, um, especially night time. Yeah. In that case, they have to see a vascular surgeon yeah. to have some bypass surgery or stent put in like that. Yeah. Okay. But this one is quite good. Yeah. Okay. The best exercise for circulation is walking. Yeah, 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 yeah. Do you walk a lot? Yeah, I do. I do. Even more when I'm working. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah. We normally recommend walking about thirty minutes every day. Yeah. Yeah, because walking can improve your circulation. Okay. So we cannot change your whole like a uh, the blood vessels. You know, when you walk, you get blood supply mainly. The two arteries, you know, two arteries. Yeah. Um, that's a tibial artery here, yeah. the posterior tibial artery, and then you have like a dorsalis pedis on top here. Yeah, okay. yeah. two major arteries that supply blood on your leg or foot. Okay, we cannot change much in the big arteries, but yeah. if you walk, you know, if you walk every day, then you can have some better circulation with a, like a new capillaries, mm -hmm. you know, small blood vessels. Yeah, yeah. When you walk a lot, you can have more like a small blood vessels and they can improve. But at the moment, it's fine. Mm -hmm. So have you had a change to your medication for only, diabetes? Only though he's given me one extra tablet. Ah, that's why the sugar, that sugar down, they went mm -hmm. down. Yeah, okay. he's given me, uh, plus, you know, I, I have been, you know, I yeah, have been eating eat much better than what I was. Yeah, so you control your diet as well. Yeah, yeah. Mm. That's good. good. Now, to control your sugar, the first thing is you have, you have to keep taking and monitor your sugar level. Mm -hmm. So when the sugar level is high, then change in the, the medication or increase the doses, whatever, so we can actually bring it down. Okay. Yeah. And then also, you have to do exercise. Yeah. So because if you do exercise, which means like you use your muscle, so muscles yeah. consume sugar in your blood, yeah. so they can help to control your sugar better. Mm -hmm. And then also you have to control diet, you know. Yeah. You have to do like the three things all together, mm -hmm. you know. Then you can control better. Yeah. 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 But now anyway, your sugar level is under control, mm -hmm. but maybe do more like a diet control yeah. and exercise yeah. like that. Yeah, yeah. Definitely do that.